Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Good morning guys, with me again Nardia Sepianta as, as your English teacher of course Well, fortunately we still have to do things this way You know, online meeting Well, this is not actually a meeting This is just a video lesson for you And also, before I'm telling you What exactly that we are going to learn today I'm going to ask you a question first Like, how are you doing these days? Are you fine? Well, I hope that you are fine, okay? Um, because these days uh, the weather is kind of bad, you know, it's raining outside like from uh, noon until night or something like that. I don't know. Well, I hope that you're fine, okay? All right. Yes, uh, last week we learned about... Um, we learned about... What, what exactly did we learn about last week? <laughs> Last week we learned about how to introduce ourselves and how to introduce others. Jadi kemarin kita kan sudah belajar bagaimana cara mengekspresikan, uh, memperkenalkan diri sendiri dan juga memperkenalkan orang lain. But now we are going to learn a new lessons. But the question is, what exactly the lesson is? Can you answer? Well, you don't have to answer actually because you will not know the answer. I'm the only one who owned the answer. Okay. All right. So right now, without further ado, I'm going to tell you. Uh, The exact thing that we are going to do and the exact thing that we are going to learn today. Jadi sekarang saya akan um, beritahunya, oke? Okay? Jadi sekarang kita akan mempelajari tentang mengekspresikan sesuatu juga, tapi bukan lagi tentang memperkenalkan orang atau memperkenalkan diri sendiri. But this time we are going to learn how to express congratulations. congratulations. Jadi bagaimana mengekspresikan Uh, ucapan selamat kepada orang lain gitu loh. Nah, this is actually kind of easy ya. Yeah? If if you pay that if you pay attention to the lesson of course. <clears throat> That's why I'm here to deliver the lesson itself. Uh, I hope that you can get the whole point because this is actually not a complicated uh lesson. Okay? All right guys, before we come to the real deal here, I'm going to tell you something first. Something important, something really really important. Okay. I'm going to tell you uh, the reasons why you need to learn more about expressing congratulations and, and and what exactly the thing that you can get after learning this lesson. Okay, I, I'm pretty sure that you you're asking this kind of question in your mind somehow. Okay, so first thing first, why the reasons why you need to learn this lessons? Why I'm going to let you know why. Okay, I'm pretty sure that one most of you might know the meaning of congratulations. It means selamat, okay, right here. But uh, probably you only know how to express congratulations in that way. Uh, in this case, I'm going to tell you other ways, okay, other ways in uh, expressing congratulations, okay. There are actually many things that you can say in order to uh, express this kind of expressions, okay. Not only congratulations, my friend, hey, congratulations, hey, hey, congratulations, this, on this, on this, on that. No, not like that. It's more than that, actually. You can use a lot of expressions. Now, the second one is what exactly that you can get after learning this lesson. Of course, the only, the one and only is you are going to be able to use the expressions that should be used in expressing uh, congratulations. Nah, jadi guys, uh, di sini bakal ada dua hal ya, yang dua hal penting. Yang pertama pasti kalian bertanya-tanya itu ya, kenapa sih harus pelajaran ini pak? Uh, padahal kan nggak bakal digunain sehari-hari gitu loh. Nah, siapa bilang? Because this language is an international language, that's why I think uh, penting ini loh. Karena ini bahasa internasional, makanya kalian perlu tahu lebih lebar gitu loh. Bukan hanya mengucapkan, hey congratulations, hey selamat ya, gini-gini. Tapi banyak caranya uh, mengucapkan selamat itu di dalam bahasa Inggris. Banyak caranya, oke. Okay? Banyak ekspresi yang kalian bisa gunakan. Oke, okay? yang kedua, seperti yang saya bilang tadi, hal apa sih yang bisa bakal kalian dapatkan setelah mempelajari pelajaran ini? Hal yang kalian dapatkan adalah, kalian bakal lebih tahu bagaimana cara menggunakan ekspresi dalam uh, menyatakan atau mengutarakan selamat kepada orang lain. Gitu. Jadi bukan hanya mengatakan, congratulations, congratulations Dinda, congratulations Andi, congratulations Agus, congratulations Bambang. That's so boring, right? So that's why I'm here to tell you the different ways of expressing congratulations. Alright guys, as I promised you uh, from the beginning, I'm going to make it as simple as uh, possible for you so you can understand them uh, you can understand the lesson easily okay 
So right here, we are going to divide two categories in expressing uh, congratulations. First one is how to express, and the second one is how to respond. Okay, how to express means uh, the way you express things, and how to respond means the way you respond things. Okay, jadi kita bakal dua bagi dua kategori di sini. Saya akan mencoba untuk uh, membuat pelajarannya ini sesimpel mungkin supaya mudah dipahami ya. Yang pertama itu tadi ada how to express. How to express itu adalah bagaimana cara kalian mengekspresikan uh, congratulation ini. Jadi kan nanti ada beberapa ekspresi yang bisa digunakan. Oke, okay? jadi bukan hanya menggunakan congratulation. No, not like that. There are more actually. And then also the second one is how to respond. How to respond adalah di situ kalian ak uh, akan mengetahui bagaimana cara merespon akan sebuah pernyataan selamat dari seseorang, oke? Okay? Jadi jangan nanti kalau misalkan uh, dikasih ucapan selamat, ya ini namanya manner sebenarnya, lebih ke manner, lebih ke tata uh, adab kalian loh sebagai manusia gitu loh, sebagai orang, sebagai anak Adam, sebagai apalah itu ya. Nah jadi nanti kalian akan belajar tentang itu. Jadi apakah membilang apa ya? merespon dengan thank you ataupun semacamnya bukan hanya thank you tentunya jadi nanti kita akan melebarkan sayapnya lagi ke sisi-sisi lain tentang bagaimana cara merespon dan juga mengekspresinya oke okay. uh, sebelum kita gali lebih dalam lagi di sini saya ingin menyatakan lebih tegas oke okay, tentang apa sih itu sebenarnya ke congratulation saya ulangi lagi expressing congratulations means you congrat you appreciate someone's effort or something like that jadi di sini kalian menghargai usaha seseorang ya jadi kayak memberi ucapan selamat ya intinya adalah memberi ucapan selamat oke okay? nah jadi jangan bingung apa up noun itu apa uh, expressing congratulation nah jangan bingung lagi karena itu adalah simply mengucapkan selamat atas seseorang oke okay? nah the question is but how how to congratulate others oke okay? nah jadi mari kita lihat beberapa ekspresi Ya, yeah, ekspresi yang bisa kalian gunakan untuk mengucapkan selamat. Okay, let's see uh, the expressions that you may use in the future in congratulation other uh, in congratulating others, of course. Okay, all right. Now, expressing congratulation others. Check. All right. First, second, third. Four, fifth, and nah, okay. Untuk lebih jelasnya, silahkan perhatikan gambar berikut. Okay. Oh, sorry. Okay. Now pay attention to the picture. Okay. As you can see from the picture, also from the point that I show earlier. Okay. There's the first expression that you can use is congratulations, my friend, or congratulations, blah blah blah, and you can uh, fill the rest. Okay. Jadi isi aja blah blahnya itu dengan apa? Congratulations, Andy, or congratulations, my friend, congratulations, uncle, congratulations, brother, or something like that. Okay. Nah, yang kedua itu adalah um, congratulations on your blah blah blah. Okay, nah congratulation on your bla 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 itu isi aja terserah apa mau isi. Misalnya congratulation on your promotions, congratulations on your uh, graduations or something like that. Okay, nah jadi kayak islamat ya atas kelulusannya, islamat ya atas promosinya. Jadi isi aja di ujungnya itu dengan apa misalnya kalau promotion ya pro, promosi promotion. Kalau misalnya kelulusan graduations isi aja uh, selebihnya. Okay. And then you can also use a what exact what what else? Um, you maybe you can say nice word. Okay. okay, that's the whole point of how to express congratulations. Okay, easy, right? You just need to remember uh, these expressions, and after after this, you may use them in real conversations. All right, now how to respond to a congratulation others? Check. Okay, first. Second, third, now what's left to explain? The example. Okay. Sekarang kita ke contoh. Gimana? Pastilah kalian itu bertanya ya. Mister, contohnya gimana sih gitu? Kalau dalam percakapan itu gimana contohnya? Okay. Nah sekarang I'm going to give you an exact example of how to using uh, this expression and how to you respond by using the expressions that we just discussed. Okay.
Alright guys, that's it for today's lesson. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for paying attention to the uh, this following video that I send you. I hope that you can understand the lesson very well. Okay. Um, as for the assignments, I'm going to send it into our e-learning. You may uh, you may check it out there, and you all, you may also find the instructions uh, regarding the assignments uh, itself. Okay. Jadi um, sampai di sini dulu pelajaran hari ini. Untuk tugasnya akan saya kirimkan ke e-learning. Uh, dan batas tugasnya itu bakalan besok, oke, okay? uh, selasa Rabu hari Rabu itu sudah harus uh, submit semua tugasnya. So, tugasnya akan saya bikin simple, oke, okay? uh, mengenai materi ini. Jadi silakan cek di air learning bagaimana uh, tugasnya, oke. Okay? Dan jangan lupa absen. Oke, okay, that's it guys. Thank you so much. Bye bye.